champion. It is Marcel Cicic. The ESL R1 major champion, Marcel Cicic. I live here in Karanjkesi with my brother and with my parents. Who got me into racing? The first clear memories about motorsport it was watching the F1. That passion has just stayed with me, you know. Probably it's coming from my mother and my father. Back then they were going to watch rally races. They bring my brothers also. We were going to do some go-karting. We wanted to race against each other and all the stuff, you know. My brother found out sim racing. We got our first wheel in 2008. Uh, it was a really, really basic one. It just could turn like uh, 90 degrees to the left, 90, 90 to the right, and it had only throttle and brake. But we were really, really happy with it. This is how my interest in sim racing started, and uh, I'm doing sim racing since that moment. Wow, 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 what emotion, what raw emotion, not just from us, not just from the team, but from the crowd as well. Of course, back then I couldn't dream that I'm gonna reach this kind of level, like in sim racing. If I told to my eight-year-old myself that once I'm gonna be here where I am now, I think he, he would be really proud, for sure. Hogy amikor megnyertem, ugye? Akkor mit éreztetek? Sírtunk. És végtelenül büszkék voltunk. Meg egyébként is büszkék vagyunk. Ja, tudom. Mind a három utakra. The most stressful part of the race weekend is definitely the qualifying. I'm, I, I was being so stressed that uh, I could even hear my, my heartbeat sometimes, you know, like beating. Marcel Cincic once again starts feeling that pressure that's all over his shoulders. I never really met this kind of stress in my life. When I was doing the online rounds from home, I was just like uh, getting out from the seat and walking around the room until the countdown was hitting 30 seconds left. Somehow it was helping to remove the stress. I felt better than being in the cockpit with my own thoughts, at least taking away my attention. You know, it was crazy, for sure. Chinchik though, loses a place. Should it stay like this, Chinchik will not be going through. I would say like the, the stress level through the season, I think it, uh, it got the worst in the middle of the season. Around round four or five, I got a bit lost in the mind. Currently seventh, not good enough. Can he improve? No, this is not the best form we're seeing from Marcel Cincic right now. I was blaming myself so so badly, not not really blaming the others. When I, I, I do some bad performance, I always try to find a mistake in myself, what I did wrong. I was angry on myself. Like. When I'm adopting myself or like I'm being in like low moments, I'm the only one who can do against it. I have to decide it in my mind that I can do better, I can be better. I have a, a really good supporter, <laughs> like through the whole season, uh, I met with her like on, on, on social media and, and she's like uh, supporting me like uh, uh, many ways, so I'm I'm really really thankful for that. Yeah, especially for my parents also because they gave me the chance for this whole thing. Of course, I I wanna make them proud. People are not around you physically, but you know that they are around you in soul or something. That's a really great motivation. I need uh, that kind of people supporting me to be back on the top again. Chintik and Baldwin on the foot row. Let's get the lights on and get this race on the way. Baldwin is leading, Chintik is second. Could this be the last race? Five kilometers then left to go. We so we, we went to the last lap. James was still leading. I was being really close to him and he was defending. It will come down to the very final chicane. I, I know that he's going to go defend on the inside, so I was trying to go to the outside. I was trying to make the chicane, but uh, I had no space anymore. I decided to cut the chicane, 
but already in my mind I decided that I'm gonna hand back the position to James. I was slowing down and after that I, I saw that Arhan and, and James had an incident. James spun, Arhan went by, he won the race. He's gonna come through to win, it is not done yet! I can't believe what we've just seen. We are going to a seventh race. I was being really exhausted and didn't want, want to go for race seven anymore. One final potential fantastic race. What's going to happen? Are we going to see the champion crowned? Marcel Cincic once again starts feeling that pressure that's all over his shoulders. You know, like uh, being called in sim racing is, is for sure really important. Every time, like, my hometown is just coming to my mind. It's, this place is really close to my heart. I like it. <laughs> I really much. She likes the camera. He's erratic, he's crazy. He does this, he does that, he does what he wants. He, he, he can be a bit wild, but there is something about competitions like this. His mentality, it just matches it really, really well. He is just super calm. The red lights will be coming on. Marcel Cintic, here goes McCauley around the into all of them, they're all over the case. And this is massive for Marcel Cicic. He's nearly a second lead for the Hungarian. At this moment, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking back to the whole season, all of the hard work I, I did. Four months of crazy racing, preparing every day. I was looking forward to get home. I wanted to do not just for myself, but also for my, for my family. That gave me some plus motivation. Just one more trip around this circuit for Marcel Cicic to take this title. The gap, of course, comfortable. I am reaching the last corner of the last lap. I realize now that I'm, I'm gonna take, take the win and take the trophy. And he is to be crowned our first champion. It is Marcel Cicic. It's just worth to prove yourself what you are able to do, what you can achieve if you, you trust yourself. That's what nice about sim racing. You can have low moments, you can have pretty bad moments, but when you are on top, those are the moments worth to do. A look at the emotion down Amazing. there as well. Your spring major champion, Marcel Cicic. So after I won the major, my boss congratulated me. Like uh, he wrote to me on Discord actually. We keep pushing, pushing. <laughs> So, and also after that, he asked some advice, some settings for Lensport, so maybe he wants to race next season. <laughs> being the best from 40 drivers, doing so many laps, so many hours, everyone was being on the limit to realize, actually I could do it. It's still hard, but I, I start to believe it, you know. It's just probably giving me more motivation for the next one, being hungry for this again, you know.